What is up guys? Today I'm here to talk to you about the Super Overdrive SD1 by Boss. I bought this thing for around $50 and I think for $50 this thing is really good for the money. I would suggest it as a great budget pedal for anybody just looking for a standard overdrive more or less. The Super Overdrive has a different characteristic to it that you would typically find in a Tube Screamer. A Tube Screamer is more or less the standard for overdrives and uh, the Super Overdrive has a bit more mid-range honk to it and I would say it's a bit grittier and dirtier than a Tube Screamer. I wouldn't say it's transparent at all. It really has uh, that kind of mid-range hump to it that is noticeable when you go to play through your amp. But overall it's a very usable overdrive here and if you're looking for something that has that that meatiness to it I would suggest the Super Overdrive. Uh, personally for me I, I prefer more transparent overdrives that complement the amp a lot better but the Super Overdrive is its own beast and I think it's well worth checking out. It comes with your standard three knobs right here. You got level, tone, and drive. It does really well as a boost for your uh, distorted channel. It does really well as a nice grit box when it comes to playing through your clean channel and trying to dime the drive. On top of that, Boss is known for making really great durable pedals and this thing's no exception. It comes with the standard Boss case and it just looks great on your board and it's probably going to last a really long time because these these pedals can really take a beating and it's pure metal so you don't have to really worry about it being destroyed or anything but overall I'm really impressed with the Super Overdrive I think it's a very solid pedal I wouldn't say it's the greatest pedal on earth but for fifty dollars I think it's pretty dang good so check it out if you are in the market for the Super Overdrive. Okay, this is the clean channel with nothing on it. And this is the clean channel with the overdrive on.
Okay, let's see what this sounds like when you push a distorted channel with this. This is the distorted channel with nothing on it. And this is the distorted channel with the overdrive on.